Hey, what's going on guys? So I'm here today at Back Bay Fitness and in this video I wanted to cover how to do a proper barbell squat without injuring your lower back, okay? And Emily Powell is going to help me with the video today, so she's going to be demonstrating the exercise while I'm kind of giving instruction on the side, right? Okay, so go ahead and face me. So I'm going to have her just kind of doing a few reps and then during the exercise I'm going to be explaining what's happening to lower back during the squat, okay? So pretend she's holding a barbell squat up here. So typically you're going down nice and slow, okay? You're pushing off of your heels, trying to keep all the tension in the glutes as much as possible, okay? She's going up nice and slow on the way up as well, so everything's very controlled. Notice that she's kind of poking her butt backwards a little bit on the way down. Now, here's how the pressure works on the lower back. So notice that she's coming down, she's keeping her back very straight, so this is reducing the pressure on the lower back. However, what happens sometimes is if you go too low, there's a wink that happens at the end right there, okay? So come up really quick. Okay, now go back down. So notice straight, 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 straight. And then notice that wink at the bottom. Now that's when the most tension is gonna be on your lower back, okay? Just so come back up from that point. Okay, and go back all the way, good. Now what I would recommend if you have a lot of lower back stiffness, and just generally if you wanna reduce the tension in your lower back, is go down and find that point right before that wink happens and then go up from there, okay? And that's gonna reduce the amount of tension in your lower back tremendously. All right, so I hope that helps.